Let's get right to it. This is going to ruffle some feathers, but I'm okay with that. You can't make an omelet without breaking a few eggs. College degrees for IT roles are a waste of time. Almost all of them are a joke. The biggest jokes are the master's programs in faker science and machine learning. Let's start off with a well-known fact about machine learning in the real world. The majority of machine learning is data sourcing and data cleansing. That current number is around 80%, and I think that's very low. Now, this isn't something I've made up. This is a well-known fact, and it's been around for a long time. So, if data sourcing and data cleansing are 80% of the job of a machine learning engineer, can you show me a college program where 80% of the training is data-related? Did you know the failure rate of big tech for machine learning positions on the phone screen is 99%? If 99% of the people can't make it past the phone screen, surely there's a disconnect somewhere. That disconnection is academia. Let's go back to data sourcing and data cleansing. I've shown that 95% of all machine learning roles right now have SQL as a top skill. How many college grad programs are teaching data sourcing? If they are teaching it, they're doing a horrible job at it. The people I've interviewed don't know what a clustered index is or what a data type is. This is just data sourcing. It's worse for data cleansing. I've never had a candidate answer this question correctly. Can you tell me a few different approaches to imputation and your reasoning behind that answer? Also, can you tell me how to implement those? Preferably in Python. Removing missing values, imputation, is one of the easiest and most fundamental things we do in machine learning. If you don't know what that is or how to apply it to your data set, how are you going to do the more advanced things? Psst, you aren't. If you're getting a degree at any level and you think it's a ticket to a high-paying job in machine learning, I'd seriously recommend some antidepressants in your future. If you don't know how to source and cleanse data, then you can't do 80% of the job of a machine learning engineer, and companies aren't going to hire you. It's your money and your time. If you want to blow that on learning theory, that's fine. Just know that's exactly what you're doing. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and have a great day. We'll see you soon.